Check this out. These are some beautiful looking glass widgets which I have set on my home screen and the same can be placed on the lock screen as well. And you may be wondering that this could be a KWGT widget pack, but no, this is not a KWGT pack. This is a simple application called Glass Widgets using which you will be able to set these beautiful looking widgets on the home screen as well as on the lock screen. And this is a premium application which is quite reasonably priced. So before you go ahead and buy it, I would like to showcase what exactly this can do so that you know what you're really buying. And this is not a promotional video. I'm not really trying to promote this application. I actually found this application very interesting and I went ahead and bought this on Play Store. Now, before we go ahead and check this out, if you're new on the channel, be sure to hit the subscribe button and become a part of Apex community to know your phone better. And do not forget to hit the like button. Your likes will take this video to reach many more people. And I really get motivated when I see more likes. So go ahead, hit the like button. Now without wasting any further time, let's dive right into the video. Now you can see on my home screen, this is a compass widget which works live. It'll show live directions right on your home screen. You got this beautiful looking clock. I got storage and the weather widget and I've got a shortcut for YouTube. You got this beautiful calendar and check out this search widget. It looks pretty cool. We can access Google search. We can directly access incognito tab. We can access the phone's assistant and we can also access Google lens directly here. And at the bottom, you can see this beautiful widget, which has got all these social applications. You've got camera, WhatsApp, Telegram, X, Facebook, as well as Snapchat. Likewise, there are 350 plus glass widgets offered on this application, which are just incredible. Now, how do we set this up? Is it really difficult to set it up like the KWGT widgets? No, all you need to do is just go to Play Store and download Glass Widgets. I have left a link for you to download this application. The link is in the description. Just download it and open the application. And instantly you will see these beautiful looking widget categories here. We have got apps, battery, custom apps, calendar, analog clock, digital clock, compass, contacts, earbuds, watch, folders, games, AI shortcuts, music, note and list, pedometer, photo, personalized, quick settings, quotes and facts, Google and search, screen time, weather, counter widget, device info widgets. Now these are just the categories and when you tap on a specific category, let's say for example applications, we have got shortcuts for all the applications. We can bring these widgets right on the home screen. You can add them on the dock to make it look uniform. Then we have got these beautiful battery widgets. Then we have custom applications widgets. Here you can see we have got social app combo, social app combo glass, Google app combo which includes your Chrome, Gemini, YouTube, Google Photos, Mail and Play Store. Then we have got the same combo in glass effect. Then we have got AI app combo which includes a bunch of AI applications, ChatGPT, Gemini, Grok, etc. And we have got the glass version of the same. And you can also swipe towards the right to get the square versions of these applications. Then we've got calendar. We've got some amazing calendars available here as you can see. Then we've got analog clocks. We have digital clock. Compass, Contacts, Earbuds, Watch, Folders. We've got Chrome Dino Game. By tapping on the widget, you can directly access this game. Likewise, we have got tons of widgets available on this application. And to set it up, you don't really have to go to the home screen and add a widget like we do it on the KWGT widgets. All you need to do is just open this application, select a specific widget that you want to select and tap on add. It will be available right there on your home screen and you can place it wherever you want. And most of these widgets are interactive. Like for example, if you want to access YouTube, you can tap on the YouTube widget. You want to connect your earbuds. When you tap on connect, it will directly take you to the Bluetooth menu. You can select which music application you want to set it for a widget and access that music application. Likewise, many of these widgets are interactive. And you can also customize these widgets. All you need to do is just go to the settings on the application. Here you can see we've got widget color settings. We can change the shape icon color and shape color and transparent color. Now, for example, you can see we've got yellow accents on these widgets. If you want to change it to a different color, just go to the widget settings, tap on shape color and select maybe let's say green and tap on select and save. Now you can see all those widgets which have got the accents will get this effect. 
And you can also see this beautiful note application. This is a standalone widget. It doesn't give you access to Samsung notes. You can tap on this to create your own note here. You can create the note and add it and save it. And that note will be available right here on your home screen. We also have options like 24 hour format, temperature you can change. And we have got padding option here. This is a very important feature which the developer has added. It says if widgets appear small in the grid, increase the value to align it better on the home screen and to make it look better. Now I have increased it and set it to 132, which is looking better on my home screen. Now I'll also give you one more tip here. By default, when you set these widget, it may not look perfect on your home screen. What you do is go to Goodlock application and tap on home up module here. Here tap on home screen. Now here scroll down and select home screen grid. Now I have set six by seven home screen grid, but it's important to select this specific option which says view widgets larger. It may not be visible properly depending on the widget. Now if you select this particular option, the widget will look much better. The content within the widget will expand and it will look really good. So you can try this specific feature if the widgets are not looking good on your home screen, just go to this particular option, home screen grid, and select view widgets larger option and apply it. That is when the widgets would look better. So go ahead and do that. Now let me show you how to set these widgets on your lock screen. Now, if you love this wallpaper on the lock screen here, this is available on our wallpaper application Wallverse. You can check this wallpaper on the recently added category called Surreal. You will find that wallpaper under this category. Go ahead and check that out. Now, let me show you how you can set this up. All you need to do is just press and hold on the lock screen, unlock the phone to enter the uh, customization options. And here, you need to make sure you have Lockstar installed on GoodLock. You will see Lockstar right here. Tap on this. And here you have got App Widget option. Tap on this and scroll down to search for glass widgets application. You've got glass widgets right over here. Tap on this. Now from here, we can add any widgets. You can see it's almost about 369 widgets we have. Any widget that you want to add on the lock screen, you can go ahead and do that. Right now, I'm on the One UI 8 unofficial beta on my Galaxy S25 Ultra. So this particular feature is not working on this device, but if you're on a stable One UI 8, you should be able to add these widgets on the lock screen using Lockstar module. So go ahead and try this out. And not just this, the application also offers some amazing wallpapers. Under wallpapers tab, you can get some cool looking wallpapers here and apply it on the home screen. That's about it. This is an amazing widget application that you should check out. You don't really need KWGT application for this. Just download the application and start adding the widgets on your home screen or lock screen. That's about it. The link for the application is in the description. Like I said, it's a premium application and this is not a promotional video because I liked it. I wanted to showcase this with you guys. Let me know what are your thoughts. Drop a comment and while you do that, be sure to subscribe to the channel and do not forget to give this video a like. Thanks for watching. You guys take care and stay safe. Cheers. Bye-bye. Bye.